수호령께서 불법적 표를 속삭여 주셨습니다. 행운의 부적 철전 판매 중입니다. 이건 불... 오케이. Let me know if it works well. I think it should. Yeah! An Apex Predator! 오늘은 얌전히 있기로 약속했잖아요, 아이들. 혼자만의 시간을 가져도 될까? 하... 찾는 사람 확대... Let's go. Looks nice.
그를 들고서 가장 앞에 선다는 게 그리 쉬운 일은 아니더라고 내가 무너지면 내 가치를 여기서 증명하겠어 방해하지마 25 hits and still a triple pass. So that's the pass. Increase HP every time. Also increase the HP every time. Also the same effect as that Does that work in area? You know, that's not. Well, that's pretty good. The Roy is still the same debuff of this ability. No, it's totally different. It's more for PvP. That's... I think his uh, a SR version is still better for PvP. He doesn't really have any de debuff for PvP. I'm in the PvP. His stats are a little too low. So I don't know yet. So, if when it comes to the other striker, Chiyu, for example, has. Yes, that's a lower compared to Chiyu as well. Even though she has a high evasion, though. Lower HP. Attacks are pretty similar. Defense much lower as well as evasion, but she has a spe like a counter where the if she basically she can counter attacks, but it's the damage cancel skill. So she should be able to take one like special hits from other characters. Compared to Sigma, yeah, it's much lower stat. Compared to Horizon, I guess it's somewhat comparable stats, but Horizon also have a invincibility buff. Chion also similar stats when it comes to HP and attack, I guess. But Chion is much better. But if you think about why you don't really get to use a Shion that much because of the sniper. Like, long as sniper isn't around, he's somewhat decent. But... Hmm. He has like two counters. Yes, yeah, still hard to fight against sniper. So. I 
I think it's going to be hard to do. So. I'll use a uh, this set uh, here. And I'll see how she does in PvE first. I guess dive is the hardest one right now. So it's probably still good to use a Sigma instead. Uh, but we'll we'll see. We'll see how she does here. I think it's her thing does not work for PvE, I think. Yeah, assuming it does not work in PvE. Where she gets 200% damage boost, but it has cost. So you can attack the back unit. Yeah. Pretty useful, I guess. Purple nods and see. That's the crafted object stage, so that one is pretty easy. So this one should be easy to go through. Guess it's hard to take a benefit of the her special counter. Build. She just has high damage. Her only survivability is that she's able to notify a damage when she she basically has a counter ability. That's a way for her to withstand like one big damage from the opponents. In return, she has a really low HP. Defense is okay, her evasion is somewhat okay. And she can also prioritize the back units. Dude, that's pretty good, I guess. So her ideal feature would be tank units somewhat doing things at the front while she attacks the enemy. Well, her damage seems pretty good. I think it's actually faster than when I use a support. Not faster. They're similar as when I use a Sigma. So I think this might be a decent team for a dive. No, she doesn't. So this is just her raw damage. She has 200% damage boost against the enemies with the three costs are lower uh i think that's only for pvp though let me double check let me double check uh let me double check the skill here so her passive is yeah except her alts all her attacks are 200 increased by 200 percent so it's not a surprise that she has that damage. It's just that with the PvP to apply that damage, she has to um, attack the target three costs or lower. So she won't be doing that much good damage against like 
anything that's above 3 the 4 cost units against that, not that great. But I think I can see her melting like 3 cost rangers pretty easily. I'm using some uh, tank I'm using my uh, awakening to get damage resistance and the other At least with this type team, it seems to be working pretty good. And I haven't taken anything that gives me absurd amount of stat boost. I guess I gave, I accidentally picked up the 10% counter damage, but I don't think that should really increase that dramatically. Let's see what's the lost artifact is. So I didn't really pick up any artifact that really boosts my damage that much. Like the problem here is, yeah, this right here. So if I can't pass this stage, I can't really use this team as a auto compatible. Most like I have to kill this thing before the barrier runs out. Otherwise, it's not that great for 100%. Yeah, it's not good enough. Unless if I get a maze gear, that might be different. But the next bit of damage. So for full autocom, I don't think it's good. Sigma. The Sigma is able to block things from the siege units with her tower, airburn. Just selecting a little bit, like. Maybe like 10%. Maybe if I get her to C3. Maybe. We'll do that. But in this stage. I was just still using it. It's okay if you don't have a Sigma, I guess. But uh, if you have Sigma, it's the best character to use. Damage is pretty good though, I guess. Sigma is better. Her ult just works so much better. With a bunch of enemies and she can just shoot roll forward. If she shoots backward, I guess it's not as good. I'm like seriously hungry right now. I was gonna eat before two, but they opened the server a little bit earlier. Um, I haven't ordered any food in like months. I might order something right now. I'm not sure what I can order this time though. Hmm. Well, we're gonna go and play through the story, so. 
we gonna go and play through the story yeah that's the uh, it's a uh, persona version so we'll see i guess it's a little spoiler from the it's a little s spoiler from the story i guess <laughs> Yeah, she eats pretty well. And while we at it, uh, we'll just take out these two tickets. I wonder how it works against like a summon spell. I do wonder. Mm, I feel like it's still going to be hard to use though. Still going to be hard to be hard to use. So able to block one thing. Just the blue bridge. I guess blue bridge isn't probably a best way to use her against, or use against her. I think she seems to feed up from her passive skill pretty nicely. Another scenario could be... I guess this is probably the worst matchup with many awakening units. Because that means her passive skill or the damage boost at 200% is pretty much useless. See how much that damage she does here. I guess sniping back units pretty decent 
long as she can stay alive, but that seems like such a hard requirement. Yeah, it needs some some types of sometimes have a low cost. You know. I guess it, it did decent damage against the Regina there. It's still going to be hard to use though, just from the little usage. I don't think we'll see her that great this week. There's a Levia there. She's probably not that great against her. Even Mina could just probably melt her pretty easily. Uh, uh, huh. I'm gonna have to use the contest. Actually, Lake is probably not that bad. But if I'm pulling enemies anyway, would Lake be necessary? Would Lake be necessary? Considering her squishiness, I think I definitely need some support. I'm gonna have to use a little bit tricky like that. Yeah, let's up this way. Well, I guess Noah could be a decent character for Olivia Trigger. Sniper. I guess I will use Zendula. No, I didn't get the cup. I slept, dude. Came home from work. And I uh, fell asleep. So I could wake up now and not be tired. So I could wake up now and not be tired. Now HP set is probably the best option for her, most likely. Just can't see Simosa using her with no damage resistance. For PvP anyway. Trata is a cooldown set, so let's see how it goes. And after a couple matches, we'll go into the finish of the story. Ray, let's go. So hopefully Noel can do the many good things, otherwise I'm screwed up with protecting her.
wow, it just took out Noel that easily. I guess it really goes for the back here. Let's see the damage there. Pity. I had a pity count getting close, so no big deal. Hmm. I guess against her low cost units, especially the backline units. So let's see how fast she takes down the Specialize in take out backline against frontline units. Not the great. Like if I can melt the Ecclesia here, that means I'm liking a tons of damage. At the end of the day, it does take on um, backline units decently. But when the frontline units are so hard. Damage is there. It's not against the frontline.
I guess if she's gonna die so easily anyways, now let's give all the way with the uh, uh, damage aspect, I guess. I kinda see the point of that now. And I think they messed up with the all the server stuff. It was okay yesterday. Hmm. Hmm. Damage seems to be pretty good. Oh. That's nice. Getting close to nine hundred thousand information. Bro. I guess I didn't run and raid as much as I thought I was going to. But we need to play story before I get tired again. Let's play a couple more matches. I think there's a bug. It's like things go what the screen freeze is for you. But as you can see, Eve can damage the backline. But it likes the damage to kill front my units. 
chance to kill you. But what's so good with the frontline units not dying? If all your backline is dead. I guess it's it's pretty good. I guess the all this backline units. So Rangers are in big danger against her for sure. But your usual defender striker comp. And awakening defender like Chiyu, Sigma, and other stuff like that. Hmm, I don't know about those. Now I need her in my hand. Oh shit, that's not good. Ten was just okay. I guess the earth ult damage is pretty good as well. So against E, backline unit does not matter. It's actually probably pretty bad choice. Uh oh, bad choice. So that means I need to focus more on the other unit. a little bit more. I wonder if her attack through the back line when it attacks the aerial unit it works as an aerial attack. Oh, 
어머, 시험지가 잔뜩 있네. 아, I guess Tempest is probably not the good pick against her because if she feeds up the summon, that's a bad time. Yeah, but that thing is great damage to get. Not sure about her being meta viable. I think she's gonna vary very differently depending on a week. It all depends on which units are available, especially against the snipers. Sigma is banned this week, so I can't really test her against her for that one. But Rafaela probably fucking bad opponents to fight against. She will melt her instantly most likely, so that's no. Rosaria, that's definitely no. Sigma, definitely no. Kyrian, definitely no. It's Kyrian and Rosaria has invincibility. Kyrian has a... Um... I mean, Kyrian's soldier could be a problem, I guess. The one he summons, but the Kyrian's initial launch of the attack is so strong anyways. Probably doesn't matter. So any snipers like that, probably pretty bad. I think Chris might be a pretty hard to kill with her as well. Yuna most likely is not a great matchup either. Tons of counters. I wouldn't even say counters, just as generally anything that has a strong amount of damage, probably really hard. We'll see though. The Lada actually looks pretty good this way. I play a little bit more when I wake up, but as of right now, I'm gonna have to finish the story. So let's recap the first one. So it started off with the what happened. Episode 10. Then it also talks about the possible Eve subject. It's, 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 it has a good damage. It has a like a similar ability. It melts the backline units really well, but not the front. It says a backline sniper strike. Where did it end? I think yeah, they blew up the one of the base self destruct. They were getting ambushed. The late night the blade came out. It's the 
self-destruct and they realized it was all their plan from the start. Now he talks about the descendant pandering. So we'll see. In the orphanage, these two kids are from there. And uh, the orphanage is probably where they create a vessel for the next demon lords. And these two kids are one of the subjects. Yeah. Eve finds out that what is the orphanage people end up turning into corrupted objects. But she finds out now she's stuck here. But at that crucial moment, the Roy's grandfather walks in. That's a lot of text if I remember it now. Liam Burnett. Anyways, yeah. We'll see what the rest of the story has to say. But I'll be back in a second. I had a water. I think we'll actually order food. Give me a second. At this hour, uh, no, it's closed. Is it closed? Oh, shit. Uh, let me see if I can still get it ordered. One, two, three. Okay, there's that. Is it? Man, I 
haven't had pizza for at least like a good half year. Breaking my diet. I only have like one or two slices though. I think that should be okay. <laughs> I think that should be okay. Store is closed. Well, I guess that's no good then. <laughs> I guess I have to just finish up stream and cook something. I have to play through the story. Well, no luck then. No luck. So anyways, people are explain explaining what the Holy Grail is. It's a live person. At least that's what the followers of the lake thinks. Yeah, in their story they had a mission to go over this village. So they heard some of the rumors about it. And at the end of the day, their place was a basically test subject or test lab for Anna Macrides. After many research, uh, Anna Macready has been trying to create a vessel so she can't basically transfer herself into. But the, that village just was one of the place. There must have been much more places beside that particular one. And the place she went to rescue one of the child from, she saw there was something inside her. And to read her, she went through some of the methods Roy says, how did it go? There was a uh, tons of event that happened. And Roy says, sorry for asking. Anyway, she explains, yeah, she must be correct with that. But the Holy Grail of the vessel itself is specially, sp specially designed or formed with a talent to hold the god itself to his body. So at the end, case of the vessel is a similar thing as a Riona heart, which is the Leon that carries the Toto, the sword. Basically, they are kind of similar. Anyway, the reason the professor guy trying to find a vet, uh, holy grail is trying to summon something to this earth. It's not supposed to. Which is Eve, I'm assuming. Or is it Eve already there? Actually, I'm not too sure. Or he says, it's too complicated. <laughs> so for you, let's take a time to take a break and organize things. 17 years ago, your grandfather, he went and fought against Professor James with the Holy Grail in front of him. But anyways, at the end of the battle, the Holy Grail trace was lost forever, or as it seems like. And your grandfather has further on went with the research.
So throughout this research, it seems like the vessel is on the other side. So that's why the James guy is trying to go to the other side by using one of the instruments. Anyways, Anna McCready, for her turn of life, she sacrificed everything. She probably thought by gaining a turn of life, she could live long enough to find out where the lake is. So anyways, what the professor said about it is definitely going after Holy Grail. But Rui says if the Holy Grail is a person, that means that person has been wandering around the other side for years, if not centuries. Can we find the person? Maybe the person has already gone bad. And we are not sure about anything because they say sometimes the deepest part of the dimension has a different flow of time compared to our reality. But Morgan says that I guess uh, your grandfather has been trying to make up for the mistake he made that day. Now they are investigating where the crack could have been for T or the other side. And Morgan is opening his hands up for a bit. The Reva says, there is no gain she can get from working with them. The trade-off is the Morgan would give James to her. And she can do whatever she wants to do with him. Ruby says she will take the offer, but no betrayal. <laughs> if you betray me, I'll make sure to basically kill you in a pretty bad way. Riva crazy as ever. Crazy, crazy as ever. These are to keep repeating the same line while enjoying the peace of the mother country. So yeah, this is back in the day. Uh, Learm says, take everyone that's alive and get out of church. He will take care of this place. And Eve says, similar is exactly like how I saw in the dream. Eve, let's run away. And they ran away. Guess uh, we can catch a break breath now. I guess everyone did escape. They're all crying and stuff. And then says, uh, Eve, I will go and take a look at it to see if any other kids are left behind. You stay here and calm them down. I will do that then. In case they're still crying and stuff. And Eve says, that's okay. Got a person from the church. The kid must be in great shock, but at the same time, she's very calm about it. Just like uh, she knew this kind of thing was going to be happening from the start. Liam says that kid knows many things. With her own ability and the power, and will she was able to find the truth about this place seems like she was ready but the what was about to happen she looks uh, weak from outside but strong inside
but according to their rules, they have to get rid of all this test subjects. Even though just a little bit getting, I guess. So what they were doing is they're a little bit, like, by a little bit every day, they're basically adding, like, of the objects stuff into them slowly make them get resistance towards to it that's why some of the kids couldn't take it and turn it into one of them anyway this guy's saying they could be growing into something else in the future so to prevent that they have to get rid of all of them and Riam says you're right about that But at the same time, it says those kids are not the. It's not their fault. Even though they could grow into something that's dangerous to us, taking future away from them, is that the right thing? Is that the burnout that I know? Maybe seeing your grandson change soften you up quite a bit. That was a pretty thoughtful speech. If your good disciples hear about that, they would be very shocked. It's a shut up. You know, since I saw my grandson, which is really, you know how cute he is. Us, uh, I apologize. I guess you'll never find out since you're single. And he says, Johan, I guess that's the guy who works for the church. We basically work together. He's, he's kind of like a spy that he can use up. But anyways, he says uh, he's going to leave the president. So he'll leave there and he will take care of these kids. Predin always gives up uh, small things for the bigger picture. I'm not saying it's that's wrong. I'm just saying it's just someone has to. It's unfortunate, but something that has to be done. But just one kid, uh, or just one person could live along with them for this kid who has no future. Maybe things will change for them. Just a little bit. And if there's a hunting dog that doesn't hunt within the pack, it confuses others. My age is over. For Predwin, I left, left to the robbers, which is his son. Destroy his father. So the rest of my life I want to spend devoted to things I destroyed, which is these kids. I found a way to see if I can turn those kids away from the destruction. That's, I guess, my way of uh, making up for the regrets I had. For someone who always had a blood in his hand. And Eve says, uh, she has some favor to ask. Thanks for saving us. And he said he promised, doesn't matter how long it takes, and, uh, could take eternity, but he will not give up on them. So for now, can you wait for just a little bit and have a trust? That voice seems like there is another kid up there. Oh, that's N, I guess. Oh, thanks for coming all the way here. I just needed a little bit more bodies. I was 
confident that she was able to meet the deadline to deliver it, but of course she failed. But I can't give up the promise I made with her. Sit down, I guess. So I was testing some of these vessels. So he's turning kids into monsters, I guess. But he's disappointed that none of them was able to withstand the test. says uh, he's curious that how many times could N take that the dosage of it it's twice or fifth times I, w I hope that you will resolve my curiosity uh, Riam says James oh you're finally here that's it's unfortunate, but you're a little bit late once again. Uh, Riam says, "Seeing you like this again, again is getting tired, tiring." And he asks if he's having fun, and uh, James saying, "Yes, I am." So you're hopeless. Oh, he's using our artifacts. For the staff. That's why they were able to have a somewhat fair place. And it says uh, you're the always the one that sex. So I wonder what happened to N. She just died. I thought she could be Amy from the other side, but I guess not. Seventeen years it has been passed. It's been a while. Place where I had the last moment with the Burnet. Yeah, this place name is Regento. Little bit of the signal, but we are able to detect them here. This place definitely has a some of the cracks to the other side, of course. That day where the kids disappeared, I guess because due to us creating a crack. But anyways, get ready. We are going to create and open up the portal, basically. Who's gonna just sit here and watch that? You are. That's Roy. Yep. I guess this is our destiny. Seeing uh, last time I had a fight with Burnett, and seeing another person here is you. And Rubet is the one that helped them. So you guys are working together, I see. Rivet says, of course, this is my probably only chance that I can work with them. That's a uh, can't get a help from the late night. James says I can't stop here now. Just buy me some time to finish the room. Did I tell you I'm doing a God's work here? And they won't be able to change the fate of that. I really say he would beat the shit out of me. I don't think they have any chance against them.
먹이사슬에 따른 결과예요. They're sacrificing themselves because they fight them. We're always taking care of them pretty easily. Oh, they are going to damage the other side. Just him left. When he was a kid, he was a he was pretty decent with the instrument. Clarinet. This is my first time playing this instrument, which is kind of old play. Rubet likes the sound of instruments, or she likes the sound of the bullets more than an instrument. An explosion sound. She says, you almost take me down with you. Well, it seems like did it anyways. And he jumps in there. But he got him with a chain. So it's interesting. Even though you're just a brat, I guess you are his grandson after all. Do you know that Roy Bonnet? The fight with your grandfather here at the end of it. If I see it now, it was my victory. Because at the end, uh, someone who's going to reach for the Holy Grail is me. You cut my arms now. So I guess the Roy is holding him by the arm. The chop gets his arm cut. And he goes through the gate. I'm really surprised that he cut his own arm. He said, then I will see you later. Uh, grandson of the Burnet. I wouldn't say she's a daughter of the Dell. She's just a different version of her, basically. The Gadel is split into many different Places. But Roy says, but we won actually. That was uh, part of our plan. I thought you were going to betray us, betray us, so we didn't tell you all the details. But anyway, Roy says, just like what Morgan Grandpa said, when you are pushing mouse into the dead end, you're not supposed to push it too far. Give a bit of a route to escape and wait until it returns to his home. So I guess he put like a tracker on it or something. So I guess he's at the other side after all though. I guess we got here somehow. I guess today is my lucky day after all. I guess I have to stop myself from bleeding. Can you give the parts you have? You are... Man, can't be. I guess it was a Morgan after all. Now it's finally just you and me, James. You know, you call yourself professor and a lot of titles, but at the end, you're just a dirty old man. But that attack right there, where Jack is getting stomped in, I hurt your spine. So the rest of your life, you're going to be living without it. Without help from the others. You probably can't even do your basic games by yourself. And he's like, you're the Burnets. No, that's wrong. 
that's not the answer I want. Oh, that's that was unexpected. Anyways, Morgan, this is the Morgan here, and uh, this is for one away call. But anyways, I secured the uh, professor. Of course he did. Man, that was great acting that he fell for him. He's incredible. And to scout the location of the Holy Grail, I'll send the coordinates for this place as well. Anyway, Elizabeth says, uh, everyone get the Albion ready. We are going after the Lake of uh, Night. Anyways, let's continue, shall we, James? Is there anything more curious? How's it like getting your nails pulled out? Where is your holy grail? Who's be behind you after all? Now I remember. You are the survivor of the what the hell is tail on you? That's not too sure. It's some kind of event, I guess. It's one of the unfortunate I guess collateral damage that happened during the fall of the administrations. The size of the city and the people who lived there just disappeared out of nowhere, but no one remembered a single thing about it. I was one of the survivors there, but the files I got, I have for myself is that I, I've already been dead. The Burnett's, I guess, like the Roy's grandfather, didn't save me. I'd have spent the rest of my life being an alcoholic. After joining the Predwin and getting the new name, I swear to that name. I'm going to find out who caused that accident. Kill every one of them. And I guess the follower of the lake was to be. Uh, that reason what made me live through my entire life and my revenge for the face I can't remember which is his kids and his wife but anyways all these different accidents and stuff you're the, the one always behind it James Moriarty What's so funny about it? Are you here for such a boring reason like that? I guess you definitely lived a boring life after all. It's probably not a good idea to taunt me, James. If I make a mistake and kill you here, that would be kind of unfortunate. That event. Yeah, I guess it's been a, it's an old name. Yeah, that was uh, similar as this, what's going on here right now. We're trying to prove that the god exists. But it didn't go that well, you know why? I was uh, out of knowledge. We didn't know about the vessels at the time. So the best quality is vessels, what you call holy grail, is ready. What do you think? Do you think we'll make it work, or are we gonna fail again? Aren't you curious, Morgan? Anyway, he shot him. I guess he's just said his real name. Ace Hastings Hirsch. His, his name is Percy. Anyways, uh, put my hand on the trigger by accident. Don't act now. I'm pretty sure we can move a little bit at least. Guide me to it, James. Crawl like a bug to the way where the Holy Grail is. And your mother is here, that's what it says. Anyway, the one I found the end is lying down. We're at least glad. 
the end didn't turn into a monster. But the end that recovered his conscience was a little bit too late and became someone else. She was the one who was going towards the orphanage. So this is was from the the other events. He says I will bring her back. And where are you heading to? Wake up. Can't go there. Stop holding me. Stop burning it. Trying to mess up my thing once again. For this time for real, I will kill him. Who are you? How did you... What did you do to him? Give her back. I have to save her. Without end, I am... Nothing, I guess. So I guess they're still fighting. Got tons of these things ready in my background. As you know, these things is these monsters are the ones that corrupted by the energy from the other side of the quick fire. And this stuff I have is not really good against anything, but it has a way to amplify that thing. Just like uh putting a fire, the firecraft. So within space like this, it will create a chain explosions. I'm just curious what's going to happen after that then. So hopefully the kids use rescued here. It's far away from this point. So they won't get caught into the explosion. What? How annoying. This is something that you cannot trigger right away though. That's why you're probably trying to buy time by talking. But in that time, I'll take care of all of these. And if this N is not in the right mindset, something's controlling it. Uh, McCready's uh, freezing ability. So it was uh, on the inside. So really, his grandfather used his power to withstand the attack a little bit. But anyways, repeating myself day after day at that moment, all I can remember is the that person, which is the Roy's grandfather, trying to protect us from the explosions. And the chain I could feel on my skin. The sickness I can feel in my stomach. Once I open my eyes up, the word I face, it's just a terrible looking place here. And then it says, can you wake up Eve? Did you have the terrible dream again? 
and Eve says, that's really uncomfortable, so stop playing with her voice. I'm not a creepy human. So I guess Anna is out of her now. Anyway, in this place, the things I was injecting was part of me, actually. And this kid, like the Annie, this kid, uh, after all, she has some potential as a vessel. So that's why she was able to hold me without overflowing. But part of her, like it's part of her personality is fused with her, so she can't be called Anna McCready. And if I have to talk about the quality of the vessels, you're a much better one. So I'm gonna turn your face towards this to see with your with your own eyes. I don't want that. The little parts inside of you became this big. And this even in this very moment, it's gonna plant itself onto this land. Trying to overcome this entire world. But even then, the conscious is still remaining still. I guess her goal is to, I guess, take over her body and control these parts of the bell and make like into one once more so anyway she's saying just give up the body to me i know you can uh, take care you can withstand the power of the those parts pieces but your conscience can and she was reminding why Riam said I'm going to wait the agent Bernard here. He said he won't uh, give up on me. So he will, make, he will come here for sure. Because I'm not saying I'm the only one who can really understand you since she went through many years herself. And even he actually gets here, do you think he will actually save you after seeing you like this? But she said she will wait. Once I hold these pieces inside of me, no one's gonna get hurt. She's good at holding down. And that says, well, you can be full like that. She's going to take over her body eventually anyways with the ritual. So did she take over her body? That I don't know. This is pretty bad. Seeing with, with my own eyes, I can't believe this. This forest, no, this forest itself is getting corrupted by that piece right now. The parts we saw at Lake 4, it's not even comparable. I guess the one fortunate thing is that even without the shackles or the chains, it's not trying to attack me. So I guess it might not have a conscious. So you're saying living and seeing this thing with my own eyes. 
That is what you call the Holy Grail that holds the blood of gods. I told you to speak. I have no interest in what you think about it. But once we bring that to reality, I can see that what's going to happen clearly. I guess he was trying. Rui's grandfather has been trying to get rid of them. James says, what are you trying to do? Can't you see? I'm trying to get rid of it. You're such a hopeless person. Are you crazy? Am I, am I crazy? I'm not. Hmm. Killing the, I guess, the host of it. Just like they can't really kill the Riona hearts at the moment, has a possibility of going crazy. He says, This is not the time to not take a risk. Even that thing goes crazy to the point it kills me. I have to end it here. We cannot bring that to reality. That's unfortunate. Seeing things with your own eyes, you can't think of a boring thoughts like that. You're seeing, literally seeing the gods being in front of you. This is your greatest chance in your life. Such a hu normal human being is wasting that chance. Like I said, I'm not interested in your thoughts. Just watch here, sit and watch your plans going into nothingness. I guess this kid, she's the aftermath of the test subject for the Holy Grail. It's just like she's dreaming. I guess she has no conscience. I guess it could be better for her after all. Goodbye, this poor thing. There's another life. Something attacked her. Well, I let my guard down here. I'm surprised that someone who got here wasn't the professor, nor that Burnett. Just so old and tired. What did you do to me? What would I do with this such a weak body I have here? So I use some of the pieces into you. I guess he's about to die. I guess without Burnets, all you guys are just the guys with the guns with the fancy suits. No use of resisting. The humans not fitted for to be a vessel, just the small pieces will turn them. So let's see how long you can withstand them. After James, it's too complicated to explain all, so let's just say I'm the McCready that you know. I used a bit of the pieces to heal you a little bit. Well, at least, or his arm that cut himself, cut off himself, now turned into some kind of tentacle. But I guess uh, the God's call wasn't wrong after all. I guess the, I'm the one who reached out for Holy Grail at the end. What are you talking about? But anyways, uh, bring everyone under you here. You're saying. You know how long I've been waiting for this day? Those 
bastards from Fredwin is going to run in here any moment. I cannot uh, let them mess this up. Anyway, she's planning to kill everyone, even the followers of the lake. Come to you here, I guess. It means killing Adele as well. Ship, I guess. I guess the ship has a church as well. <laughs> it says, such an unfortunate, uh, not unfortunate, such a surprising ship. Says, uh, she says, the god, someone who doesn't believe in God is not supposed to be on board in the ship. But this is an emergency case, so that's why I lodged her in. shit so really saying uh it's not just you and me there's also another person which is morgan but he can't really think about it or he says something is wrong i feel like i f have forgotten something that's very important important though, what are you talking about it's not something i would have forgotten about who is it who's the one who's made this plan why don't you leave it up to me then i can fix uh fix your head pretty quickly so a bunch of these things are getting stuck to getting into the ship right Seems like they're not really flying to get onto the ship. It's like they're shooting it from, from the ground. It's like those things back in the day where they throw a rocket. Seems like uh, all the followers of the lake is gathered around here. But that also means there definitely is something that want to protect here. So I guess we're at the right place. Oh no. Let's <laughs> go. 
dying, I guess. There's too many of them. Well, I guess we're always fighting stuff. It's not really fit it. saying she's just a crazy bunny. She says she wants to kill the humans because corrupted objects are not that fun to shoot. So Roy wants to protect everyone but he is saying has the limits. says he's getting annoyed here. I guess I just have to take out all this profit objects here. We'll see when my power runs out. I see either one of them. Either my power running out or them disappear before that. So he's still going head on head. So one of the things is recognizing him. What did you just say? Oh shit, is it Morgan? Oh damn. I guess Morgan is turning to one of those things. Saying a burnet. Wait, what is this? Why is this thing talking? And it's also attacking the other monsters. It says burnet, go and stop it. It's repeating your name. Can you remember something? I felt it there. I don't know that thing, but. But I could also at the same time remember it. I don't like things the way he does, but he always trying to tell me something. They don't understand why the monsters are attacking each other. Attack that particular monster. That monster is opening up the path for us. It's keep telling us to go, so maybe it knows the location of the Holy Grail. We can't really understand what it is exactly trying to tell us, but we have to hurry. I don't know that thing, but it still exists. I'm going to kill it. Burn it, agent. Agent burn it. I'm gonna find who did this thing to you. And I'm gonna kill it for sure. Really, watch your back. Even though I don't remember the name and the face, it doesn't have the same shape like it used to. The time I had with him and the words he told me is still inside of me. The thing is moving. Let's go. Follow it. Follow it. He's one of the best agents in the Predwins and my master. He's definitely someone that I admire the most. I 
한꺼번 확보해 주세요. 여러분. 생전이 곧 승리죠. 근데 they got into this place so fast. So they're so fast. 음. Every bit of surprise that Rui's strength is getting much higher. The CRF's uh, growth is deeply tied with uh, their mentality. The more they can control it, the stronger they can use of it. But the other side, uh, the other way is with your emotions. And that's pretty easy to win. But it's also pushing himself. I guess that's definitely Roy's style, I guess. Just going crazy. We must have to succeed. I have to make it happen. The grass and the forest is getting deeper and deeper and longer. Uh, smell similar things, just like the Regina's house. We're definitely close, Roy. Let's run. That's such an odd thing. Our defense line should shouldn't be this weak. How were they able to run through it so quickly? Seems like they know exactly where our defense or the defense mechanics are. Seems like it's only attacking our weak points to make it through. Maybe our information has leaked out. No, if they knew about our plans from the start, their ship wouldn't have crashed to begin with. I can't remember who. Who was the hunting dog who chased after me there? And I'm not saying pretty disappointed with your performance what's happening here. I'm sorry for asking. Wasn't there a hunting dog who got here earlier than us? We are finally seeing it. The pretty big parts of the pieces. This forest, no, this world itself is all consumed by it. That's what the they call Holy Grail. Did you say Holy Grail is a person? You can't see it from a far away distance like this, but uh, we have to get it a little bit closer. Then, um. Uh, I guess we're seeing each other once again here, grandson of the Burnett. Professor. Of course, that thing brought you here all the way. It's really interesting. It's 
So I guess James learned that it's actually Morgan. Well, since the last time we saw each other, you got a faint in your arm, Professor. Of course, Ribbit. I was curious about the bodies that's not that's non-human. Never thought I would experience like this. What do you think? Just what it could do, the possibility it holds, is better than human art. It definitely fits you. <laughs> we are surrounded. Seems like uh, they read our movements and put everyone into here. Doesn't matter. Came here all the way, I'm just gonna destroy all who bothers me. I'm sorry for you guys, but you guys can't have the Holy Grail. This is my last chance seeing the gods being born. Would the gods be good or evil? Star, the Holy Grail is the only way to solve his curiosity. <laughs> you remind me of this one guy I used to know. Such a big traitor. You have something to achieve for, and you are the only one who can seal away the guess that piece she made a stairs with the Bible like that That's why the god whispered in my ear, things like that. And they're saying do not stop him because this is exactly what the god planned. No, she's still working under Regina. Well she's friends with her really. She doesn't she doesn't really work for anyone. Anyway, he doesn't seem worried that Roy's getting close to the Holy Grail. I guess I got here in time. My uh, the ground is frozen instantly. This ability, burn it. That monster is completely frozen. I guess this is the power of McCready. Of course, that's the answer. I guess compared to my prime days, it's not even half and half of it. After all, this is the body I borrowed. I heard your name before. Uh, Roy Barnett, I think. It's nice to see you. But you're about to die now, so. I guess uh, seeing a kid using McCree's power out of nowhere, I guess you're the one after all of these things. I guess you have a pretty good eyes, but I don't care who you are. I'm kind of busy here. But I'm not going to go easy on you for being against the crowd. I guess uh, seeing you, you want didn't get the, the fancy shield from the, your grandfather. Do you really think you can turn the tide here? But since you're his grandson, 
I'm a little bit. I, I'm rooting for you a little bit. So try your best. Unless you want to become the thing beside you. I'm really saying, what are you talking about? I was surprised. Those those monsters are the ones who consumed the pieces and couldn't take it because the power overflowed inside of them. But so he's a failure basically. But at the same time, he's a lost uh, remaining conscious or the I guess a remnant is uh, left inside of him. It was you. You were the one who turned in like that. Was it a man? I guess it kind of was. Well, I can't really remember anymore. At the end, it's just a monster now, so it doesn't matter. They're always just laughing. Why are you laughing? You can look crazy finally. I guess that's a good thing. I was looking for you after all. Trying to find someone who turned him into this thing. Listen to me carefully. I'm going to destroy all of you, not leaving a single piece behind. All of you with any means necessary. Uh, I guess they sent up the patch after we started. Give me a second. I don't think there's any server down for this patch. Will we do that? Remember if I did. Or was <laughs> yeah, we clear this one already? Yeah, I think this is the one we have to clear again. Oh no! And he's taking care of all these others. I guess he's really controlling the gravity itself at this point. What kind of monster is he? So I guess she's somewhat impressed. I guess he's the grandson of Bernard after all. But I guess he just uh, made uh, those pieces frozen and threw at me. Okay. 
I guess we don't, we don't have to watch this the uh, least I could do. Saying the chain you're using is made out of your grandfather's hair app, and you've been relying on that for all these years. Yeah, without those chains, you're actually nothing. Aren't you, Roy Bunner? One moment, that's more than enough. Think, think yourself, Roy Bunner. A way to destroy that bastard. A way to win. Well, when you're fighting against the other counters, usually they think about the how much power that can they release. But you and I doesn't have a good I guess way to push up power for counter. But even then uh there is a difference between you and me that cannot fill up. Yeah, but he he said the fight when you fight other counters, it's the CRF power is not the only thing that determines the victory. In my case, it's a bluffing. This is like a playing a poker. Once the enemy takes a chance to score strike for victory, you counter them. Nothing is easier than taking down someone who thinks it's about to win. This is a good way to use it against anyone with full confidence. That's another important thing that uh, on the other side they can't really rely on using power too much. Yeah, because once their power runs out, they turn it into crafted objects basically. And the chain broke finally. I guess it's the time to say goodbye, Roy. I guess you were somewhat fun. What what the hell? Where did they come from? I guess they're trying to unfroze the monster. I told you I'm gonna destroy you with enemies necessary. So hold your teeth tight. Said, I finally did it. Finally gave one punch to the bastard. Nice supports. But I guess the. I guess he said he'd been using this chain pretty nicely for a long time. But the. If I can't use the chain, that means I guess I can't contain this thing. Just like what the paper non said. It's really a person and it's still a kid. Was my grandfather really trying to get rid of this kid? Just trying to kill this one kid and going through the other side for 15 years? I. I guess the r choice Roy makes here will make a difference, but I guess uh, 
seeing an Eve right now, I guess he tr did try to take down. I guess the memory is overflowing into the world or something. You've said or you've waking up. You are. I'm sorry. But I have to accomplish this mission. That's what I promised him. He's trying to kill you. If you're trying to blame me for it, you could. So. Even if I have to kill you, I'm going to and stop the peace from here. I guess it's exactly against what the, uh, Roy's grandfather was trying to do, which was save them. Is that so? You are the agent, Bernard. What? What are you talking about? You know me? You really came here for me. Came here without being late. Too late. I'm thankful. I've been waiting for you, waiting for you here the entire time. For a long time, by al alone, I've been. Here. Doesn't matter how scared and uh, lonely I felt and painful, I held down because I'm really good at that. What are you talking about? Tell me, what did my grandfather say to you? How long have you been? I guess we're always really sympathizing. You are Bernard. You are the one who can save me from this eternity. So finish me here, once for all. I guess that's the only ending for everyone to be happy. So grandfather really tried to. The peace is inside of me until I die, I'll hold it best as I can. Just like uh, so you can't get hurt from it. I won't let it go. Roy says aren't you upset or annoyed that you left alone here until you become like this you've been waiting him for such a long time for that my damn grandfather who wasn't even sure he was able to make it you must have had tons of things that you wanted to do that you wanted to eat and you say you want me to die or let me kill you is that what you think that everyone could be happy about? You had just a breath to leap like one. What are you trying to do? Can't you see? I'm just trying to get you out of this thing. I'm going to take you out from here. What? And the Eve says, these pieces cannot be separated from I know that there is a someone who is still uh, living a somewhat normal life, even though connected by a pieces. Let's ask a help to her. If that's not the case, let's go to the Pendragon. The Pendragon will help in some way. She's definitely kind of knowing, but she would not definitely not ignore it this thing. If I ask her nicely, she'll help me some way. And there's another CEO that I know. It's kind of odd, but definitely knows a lot of people with the nice talents, so they can definitely help us. Wait, wait a sec. You say you've been holding it down all this time. So just hold it a little bit more. You're alive. 
long as you're alive, uh, we can figure out a way for you to go back to where things used to be. I don't know what my grandfather was gonna do with you, but I don't want to sacrifice someone because there's no other way. If it's the happiness comes from a killing an innocent child, I don't need it. No, I'll make it so I don't need it. So wake up. Wake up and stand and uh, cut off those parts holding you down. Walk out yourself. Agent Burns, I will help you. What a touching story. And such a, such a, I guess, innocent thought that I really, really like it. You are. But without the, doesn't matter what kind of ideology you believe in. Without power, you can't achieve anything. What about you? So all the ideal speech you just gave, can you stand by those words? Or what are you trying to do? What am I trying to do? I'm going to have a ritual for our mothers. Ritual? You are. That's what the James said about the Holy Grail. This is perfect should be able to listen to our mother. Don't do it fast. All this to become one with the lady. Bibbly day taking care of this place. And he said, just like what the God said. Uh, Anna McCready's uh, leftover is just a, a guard to defend. Out of one of you who was an uh, innocent one, we reached to the Holy Grail. The innocent one. Just like what God said to me is that uh, they will unseal and uh, really will let the Holy Grail go. Okay. Then after that, the godly things will be. I guess there's about to be um, then I'm gonna take a step back. You take care of the rest. Where are you trying to go? Take your bullets. There's no more use of that. No, chasing after him stops here. She's sensing a great danger from where the Roy is headed. The so Riva saying she doesn't feel anything. Hmm. The Bibli says, you know, this feeling I felt it before. You no, know, it's stronger. It's many times stronger than that time. But if we go there, we will definitely die. Maybe the burn it there already. Can you hear me? Burn it. Uh, what happened to the Holy Grail? Selling away Holy Grail, I failed. And with this ritual, something is gonna ascend. It's something is gonna brought to this world. So everyone go back to the ship and run away from this point. If you run away here, uh, what are you going to do? All this happened because of my mistakes. 
so I'm gonna buy time until the breadwinner arrives. You are going to hold yourself until the breadwinner arrives. He's about to play, play along with him, I guess. Oh no! Shut up, I'm getting there! So I guess he will be the boss. The next thing is perfect. After the rain gets back. I guess, uh. This is my turn finally. Compared to my mother, the responsibility I'm lacking. But the deep sleep I was in by night has collected the pieces. So many of us could become one once more. So you leave this part to me to become one as well. I don't know who you are, but I'm not gonna leave any parts of me to anyone. Doesn't matter how long it takes, how painful it is, I was about to. I was going to hold it. It's the promise I had with Verna. When is that? If you knew, the time here flows really, really slowly. The reality you were you used to be in has been passed, and it's been seventeen years. The one minute here, uh, one minute there, is about one hour here. The one who was kind of guarding you. She was Anna. She was the one who was rooting for the eternal life. Even someone like her, she could not ease the boredom, so she froze herself actually. Not only unfroze herself when whenever she needed to move. And she the same. They're using uh ability to go back to past. And keep trying to dream that moment and pass again and again. I don't want to. Probably wasn't a great memory you had, but you couldn't stop yourself from repeating those memories. Because I, if you don't do that, you'll be very lonely. You couldn't realize the fact that you're all alone when you wake up your eyes. So don't tell me that I'm lonely. Us is one for all and all for one. Back in the day, we all had different names as well as different looks. But once we mix each other's and our thoughts into one, could uh, let's go beyond the time and dimensions. Those are in the evils and able to understand each other. So give me your loneliness, your happiness, rage, and everything else. Give me everything and I'll feed on it. Then we can become one. I guess uh, this implies that the Eve and the or the Eve we know is now inside of it. She lost control of herself. I guess this her sweet dreams that everything would happen. If things 
every one of you is here. You know how lonely I was been by myself. Everyone, I'm finally here again. Guess they're all exploding. He's finally witnessing the born of gods using or having Clifus. And he's also dying. So it consumes everything as it reborns, I guess. For one, basically one for one, all for one. Beast to reach the truth. So if everyone becomes the one inside of her, those have to. What's gonna happen to Roy then? Is he going to die as well? Where is this place? The lake has to become one. Becomes one. Let's all become one. So I guess I failed. I guess savings, keeping a promise, saving someone. I guess I did not accomplish any of those. But I. I want to live. I really want to. I definitely do not want to die in a place like this. Is there anyone around me? <laughs> Just please save me, please. Just get me out of here. Does anyone hear me? Pendragon, anyone? Just... Okay, I give up, give up. I'll do whatever you tell me to do, so please. Let's become one really bonnet. Everyone's waiting for you here. Everyone's waiting to feast on you. Let's become one, our enemy. He says, I give up now, I'm tired. Just do whatever you want. I did what I could, so. I guess uh, you really were just fooling yourself until the end. And that's how you beg for mercy at the end. If you... Go to the, if you die here, you're gonna hear a bunch of things from your grandfather. Oh shit. But your just fancy speech was a good ide ideology. Or it was, it was too good that you had to give many other reasons to back it up. You're always trying to keep your good all the way through. Uh, since after all you're my disciple. You are. I guess uh, it's kind of sad. With the, all the time we had together. You forgot forget about me that easily. Morgan Serious Morgan. Resolving many different problems. Morgan Grandpa. Why are you here? What are you talking about? Were you the one telling me to get you out of here? Breath. No, I, I couldn't have a sleep because of you. You'd be surprised at how he was able to keep his conscience so well inside of him. 
That's a uh, very strong I guess, uh, mentality. But can't you become one with us finally? I guess she is very uh, impatient lady. Don't worry about me that much though. It's not much compared to what I've been through. I'm probably too late, but getting you out of here is pretty easy. What are you trying to do? Listen well. Okay, whatever the legend is, it starts from fooling the others. And if you can keep that up and turn that into reality at the end, then the legend gets this power and remember forever into people's minds. So Burnish should never die until the legend is passed on to the others and it's reborn again. Versus just don't do this to me. And it's your turn to follow, take up, or become a legend for your born it. Morgan says, I guess this might end uh, uh, to talking to the Roy's grandfather. But I'm thankful. All the things I learned from you, I gave it to him. Or actually, his bluffing is better than me. Where you, Wherever you are, if you're seeing me, uh, seeing us. I think you can't expect great things from him. I wasn't able to overcome him until the end. But him, the Roy, could. Or even beyond where he used to be. Yeah. I guess I know after all, finally. I didn't like the guy who was called in front of the door stuff. But now I finally know the meaning behind it. My duty is to stay in front of the doors and meet the legend and open door for them. I completed the mission I had, and uh, he's finally gone for real, I guess. <sighs> oh. I guess this is the Albion. It's getting attacked by a gigantic tentacle. saying the yeah whatever they're facing is the strong as the other demon lords i've been using tech level four gears that's it eve is uh The Eve is saying just stop resisting become all one with us. And it's shooting each other and stuff. And they say we well, have to become one. Some parts are from the PB I guess. Found the agent burner from the forest. What are you doing here? Alone. Answer me. There's someone that you went on a mission with. 
or someone who sent the coordinate here, right? It was Morgan. Remember him, Sadius Morgan. Morgan. He uh used his last remaining power to get me out of that place. He was sacrificing his life for me. He was like a father to me. I always was just yelling at him. Never said a thank you even once. He was the one who called me proud of it. So yeah, the demon lord, I guess Adele, whenever they turn into those monsters, their information is basically kind of deleted. Yeah, basically when Adele consumes it, that person's being or anything just disappears. So many of our members from Fredwin, we don't even have a graveyard for them. So we don't we have no way finding out who the person that died is. But if one of us just even a single person can remember them, he's not dead. He'll remember as a legend in our hearts. Legend of Crude One. There's no point of trying to fancy or Trying to use a fancy words to sugarcoat it. When he was said uh, chasing after Professor, we should have stopped him. At least to make his sacrifice worth, I had to finish the Holy Grail. All the mission he was after and trying to accomplish, I messed up at the end because of the night or whatever or the manner. So it's my fault he's dead. Don't get it wrong. I guess that's her awakening line, I don't know. That'd be pretty nice if the whole story is dubbed. But she's saying that all responsibility is onto her because she's the leader of the Predwind. Just do whatever you want. If you want to run away this place, beg for mercy. She's saying that if you want to fight with me, even after all this, wake up and uh, stand up and hold the shield. Hold the shield. And, uh, basically, she's saying that's the only thing that she can do for him. She's saying her response. She won't be avoiding her responsibility as the leader. So I guess they'll be working together forever. And honestly, Dove lines even the little bit it definitely does change many things the immersive aspect definitely exists i guess the the new game would definitely be dealt throughout many stories for sure to set the taste standard now So anyways, Eve has been born and she's saying, <laughs> I guess she's still like a child, she's saying that she does, I didn't do anything. I'm just here to collect my children, your children. Saying, Yoshi Yoshi, those uh... Guys, there made you scared. So, just come to your mother, and it just consumes it. And there, did it just eat the monster? What are you stuffing yourself for? Just keep shooting.
What do you mean I ate it? This is such a unmeta word for late. We're just we're just doing what we are supposed to. We barely got here in this reality that we need more power to keep ourselves together. So you guys as well. Become one with us. Uh, the spear. I guess Rubet is here. Wow, it somewhat looks like Adele in a way, but also different. It's a Rubet. I guess it's the first time seeing you with this body. I'm also good to, glad to see you, Adele Jr. Shot at first, are you crazy? Didn't I say we only have a one strike? It's not my fault. Seeing that made my hand itchy. How could I stop myself from it? Yeah, Kyrian is key of the Avalon and Roybun is wall of Camelot. No, I, I guess, I, I guess the symbol. Ro the Roy is kind of like the persona name is the Galahad. The, I guess the artifact they hold kind of works like that. Because the King Arthur story, they got sword. They also have the shield. Didn't they also have a spear as well? But anyways, they're saying that's not a bunny girl. That's uh, Regina McCready's right arm. Rebed. They're trying to fight against it. And it's a mother's guest, so stay quiet, pun. I guess it's one of the arm. There are so many here to celebrate the birth of Eve. Eve is very happy for them. What kind of memories can I taste from you? What is your favorite movie? The food you don't like. Is there someone that you... Someone precious that you want to protect? Maybe experience that you had losing them? Is there experience you actually killed them? I would like that. Uh, yeah, Percival. That's what's good. I think mostly I learned the King Arthur story from fake random so. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, but after all, all after all, all this thing leads to Excalibur, I guess. The sword inside the lake. I guess the this lake, after all, is a yeah, King Arthur story, so the longiness. Yeah, also from a Evangelion, that the, the spear of the longiness is from there as well. But anyways, Bibli is saying that if we bring that to reality, our world will be in hell. But anyways, uh, since everyone's here, so I can eat you all nicely. I guess I shouldn't leave any behind. Chain is here to contain it. I guess I can't move my body. Everyone get behind me. It's this our time. You are uh, T-Bomb. Giving me an order. I guess uh, you're a little confident. Nice catch. I will give you a praise for that. Get ready for next. There's no way it would be finished like that. Oh, uh, this Pendragon is here as well. I guess uh, I remember you're more fancier than I remember you from our mother. Eve wants to dance nicely, like more fancy like you. Stop uh, saying things like that, you monster. Saying those words from your mouth is just unpleasant. Keep saying, I really meant it though. Agent Burnett, you're alive after all. I guess you look definitely 
you change your outfit quite a bit for all your products. Anyways, let's have a tea, uh, tea chat later. That thing is a uh, corrupted object or high class corrupted object that got the some of the rights of the demon lords. This is our only chance when its power is still not stable. I order you, so seal it away. And he comes into interrupted. Damn it. And he cut the chains so easily. Step aside, mother. Even though it's uh even the chains is unstable as well. Getting touched by it is dangerous. Eve is happy the night is protecting me. You know, I can create many of these chains on my will now. Don't think it's gonna be the end of it. Burnish should never die. It's your turn to the legend. My watch and my spirit, even though it breaks here. I'm definitely going to slow you away. And save the kid inside of you. I think he's still definitely lacking because of his grandfather. Is a harder night. Give me a second. Let me bring different team. Yeah, so Lozetti is too high cost for this. DPS unit. Someone could heal herself. I think this should work pretty well. How I can pretty well. Mm -hmm. 
I think I could even use a maze pull that was it. I don't think I need to use a I guess I like the damage there. Let's go over that here as well. I think this should surely take it down. about it Morgan that's that's interesting damn it it's broken again the chains my grandfather gave wasn't a week like this stop complaining about it we don't have time not sure my what kind of choice my grandfather tried to take. And if I have a rise to take the place in Fred one. And if you can create a strong chain like your grandfather right now, we have no chance. It really says I definitely know that damn it. Still don't know sure. Still not sure. You're still far away from it, but still pretty sharp. The chain kind of chain shift into a shape that fits more to you. Seems like the shield has kind of accept you, accepted you. Into certain to a certain degree. What are you talking about? You're still lacking the emotions. We're going to buy you time. <laughs> River says you probably won't be able to hold it long. So if you don't want to die, please wake up early. Make up fast. It says we'll take down all of them. I have to wake up. Bleeding pretty badly. Can you move? Let's go. That means buying time for me. We have to hurry or someone else will die and get hurt as well. I no longer want to see any of those anymore. You know as well, Elizabeth. I can't not be taken down from this fight. Stop trying to get familiar with me. A friend with me. <laughs> Shut up. I don't think the choice I took was a wrong choice. And to stand up for the, and I guess take responsibility for the choice I made. That I will take up on the legend. The door you didn't go through, 
I will say this one. Damn. It's pretty cool. <laughs> I think he's still lacking though, because how strong his grandfather is. It's probably your first time you're holding the shield. Compared to the beginning, your chains definitely got to much more stronger. You're very far off though. Who the hell are you? How do you know about Predwin? That's such a foolish question. After all, I know that because the shield used to be mine. What? Take your hands off from my my people, uh, like knights of late. What's the, what's the look you have there? A wing. I guess uh, this worst pen dragon can already use something like that. That's pretty uh, interesting. But I guess you have to pay for the price for such a thing like that. Anyways. So you're saying we'll not leave any of will not let you leave any of you. And Eve says she really wants to taste for I guess. So someone who has overcome one problem and standing up here once again with your own your own will. What kind of memory if you hold inside of you? Voice says, if you want to eat me, try again. I'll make sure to puke me out once more. And he likes that. He says, uh, let's end here today, mother. Why is that my night? Even though I'm about to feast on that night. Earthquakes. Uh... Your vessel has been, or the vessel that you were so, for your for you, mother, has been planting its roots, becoming the core of this world for a long time. And the core has disappeared now. This world has met its end, and it's about to disappear. So it's probably best before we leave. Best we leave before that happens. Uh, she says, what do you think, Pendragon? Should we leave this to leave this off for here today? We'll take a step backward and let the feast for the next time. Because after all, we need a little bit more preparations. A draw? You really think I'll let that end this way? After all these, stop the nonsense. I guess Rivet and Bibelita is really badly hurt, so as the others. Elizabeth said, let's go back. Hey, you. We lost too many things today. If we lose any more than th we already lost, I don't think I'll be able to forgive myself. When we, if one more person lives, we will be able to just think something of them. So for the next time, let's go back. It's my order for the day. Get it? I guess we'll follow the order. And Eve says, I guess you're clever after all. Once we become all at the end, I definitely want to ask you about the feeling you have today. I said bye bye. We'll see you next week. I, mean, I didn't expect them to take down Steve and Lord anyway. Uh, 
So it's talking about the instruments. The old way, the instrument of the Elysium that the professor used to get to this other side. But anyways, uh, to Elysium's uh, corrupted objects, a source of its power as, at the same time as an artifact. The, the ability has blah blah blah. Oh, so that's the professor. <laughs> and Eve says, so Professor Moriarty is... Oh, it knows everything. So I guess when we use this, maybe we'll be able to have a magician in our church. I guess it'll be nice to have a magician every time we have a feast. Is there anything else? Uh, just so what, not just your professor or professor title, you were a very successful person in that world. I have a couple connections in the higher from the church and such. Giving them my name and my face, they'll definitely follow up my order. Eve says, uh, at this rate and size, it's probably hard to follow up to Regina's power. Anyways, the rebet definitely gave us a good damage. So our being would have been exposed to the others. So we'll be attacked from many other Anyway, this professor, even though after became a monster, is giving many good advice to the Eve. The Eve says, thanks for all the helpful guidance. I'll call you back when I need you. So stay calm inside me once more. Eve says, I guess creating a promised land that makes everyone happy is not easy as it seems after all. There's too many things to consider and think about. I guess everyone just puts down their ego and stuff and become one and it'll be nice. Don't you think, my knight? Don't worry about it, my mother. For lakes to become one, that's probably not that far from me. Is that so? From today's event, the uh, Predwin would have damage with a or Predimon was damaged that cannot kill the way. And they'll be grinding their teeth but it will take their time to rebuild really once more. Eve says it's unfortunate I could not taste the road but, but it was nice to see the face of the pen dragon holding down his I'm counting the days where I can taste them. I guess that's a good way or a good goal we can have. But we should consider other things first. The other things. First, we'll be collecting all the different pieces of the lake. If you are considering fighting against the uh, adult. For the place of the demon lord or placement of the demon lord. But just like the mother has a Regina, I have you. The one who fought against us after all. That's a such a high praise for you. That's just a dream that uh, that's just a past that went away like a dream. I right now is just a nice serving you. Until you get used to the power, stay in this cliff of dimensions. Your groove for now I'll lead it until then. For all the lakes to become. Eve says that she will take a nap. Go on, my 
Regina doesn't because I think she still stays with uh, Adele at the moment. But the Revet was sent out by Regina. Then, please, uh, Agent Burnett, please tell me his name was more my old friend's name. His name is Morgan, Sadius Morgan. Remember him. Morgan, Morgan, Sadius Morgan. Of course, I think it was a name like that. Send you my thank, thanks. Burn it. Thank you for giving my friend to have a name on here, and also succeeding his will as well. Can I take a leave, uh, my lady? I like to have a moment with my old friends. Of course, my Ryan. Saying that I should have been there, I should have hold you, hold you. Are you okay? If you ask me if I'm okay, I'm not. But the leaders of Predwin should not show emotions in front of the others, because that's the position I am in. So. Rather than feeling the sadness I have right now, I'd rather chew on my revenge for the future. Or my revenge for the better future. So I won't have to feel the sadness ever again. Is that so? I guess you have it heard as well. Then cry somewhere. <laughs> cry a river somewhere. I can't see you. If you don't, uh, you'll be broken. So what are you planning to do now? After this event, the uh, Predwin lost many things. But thankful that we didn't just lose things. We were able to get gain other things as well. Uh, the followers of the lake throughout different ages and time, they changed their names and goals to adapt. But the Predwin, who is supposed to fight against them, well, is stuck in the past and unable to change from it. I guess I cannot uh, look away from this. It's my uh, fault as a leader, the Predwin. So because of that, the uh, move will change. So we'll never have to sacrifice others. Not repeat the same mistake in the past to defeat the new enemy that was born today. We are going to adapt and bring in new people and get a hands on new power. So help me, Roy Bonnet, will you? Of course. Because I have something that I have to uh, take responsibility. That's good then. I guess we'll get pretty busy from now on. To face our new enemies. Uh, to face our new enemies, we are going to continue or continue again with our research of fighting an armory. Of fighting a god. There's more weapon beside the Predwin to fight against her. Told you. All these weapons or these armories are just a piece of puzzle to fight against or defeat the demon lords. Whenever demon lord destroys the world, they get their powers to the next. That mean uh, that means amount of the world the demon lord has destroyed. There's amount of uh, I guess a legacy left behind you're saying uh, that those type of armory is really hard to utilize and use and it has a problem of increasing profit of 
corruption level. Basically, this is the reason why the administration hold down the knowledge of all the technology and stuff like that. Because the more the world is aware of this type of technology and the powers, the faster it will be corrupted and stuff. Just think as like an internet. Think as in before the humans knew the internet and after you learned about the internet. Many things, I guess, got them better for good, but so has the bad side as well. But she's saying that the more we have as a trump card is always good. Damn it! Oh shit. <laughs> the first one we are going after is a sword that existed before the lake was cont contaminated. <laughs> oh shit. Here we have it. Long before my family um, use use it to I guess uh, cut the lake into pieces. It's just a lost somewhere in this world. That's all the clues we have. So we are, we'll start from there. She's talking about Excalibur. I'm pretty fucking sure Pendragon is gonna get awakening with the Excalibur in our hand. So we don't know when that will be, but that's pretty much saying that she will hold Excalibur one day. <laughs> yep. I mean, her name is Pendragon, for God's sake. So like, I came, I saw that from miles ago. Bad. Uh, Excalibur will exist somewhere. Yep. Excalibur. We all know that from the fake granddaughter, though. <laughs> Excalibur. Not four years. We don't even know if we get them now. I thought Ecclesia might hold Excalibur, but she doesn't. But it's nice to see the hint of Excalibur. I mean, I always knew it. The so Pendragon would definitely get awakening with Excalibur in her hand. That's, that's like given. Though. Well, the counter side doesn't really adapt the like the, those fair tales and the legend into one to one. They do borrow names and the settings here and there and put their own twists into it. Ecclesia most likely going to be a king. I mean, she could be King Arthur's story because the. So. I think Ecclesia is basically the King Arthur's a legend. Then, throughout many years, it branched to different parts and stuff and became what it is today. Like Kyrians, the Key of Babylon. And the people of like the people of the Curians people. Uh, they are basically kinda far their far ancestor is Ecclesia, basically. That's why they hold the key of Babylon. Well I don't think having rearmaments will stop them from giving uh, awakening though. Like, why not? That was a pretty exciting story. I guess Roy's still far away from it though. Roy still needs a little bit more to become... 
I don't want to say awakening, but he's just getting used to it. And I feel like uh, his grandfather, the reborn. But yeah, rearm is a little bit too strong. Should have gotten there early on. But my hands were fixed. I wonder if they have the new song. Let me see. I think they should. Should have new songs here at the bottom. I'll have to clear it ten times. To clear it ten times, eh? She is trying to. She has a part of the rights as a demon. Lord. She's not entirely demon lord yet. See, Adele has kind of given up on her, I guess, duty as a demon lord at the moment to be with the Regina. So we'll see. But right now she does the Tamiel did allow her to be stepped into the game as a demon lord. So we'll see if she will end up consuming Re uh, Regina or Adele. At least that's her plan. But it's the beginning. So basically we have a new threat now. But I think she is kind of like where the... I think she's playing like what Maestro was, like with the Elysium. They weren't the main, main enemies of the main story. I think main story any enemy at the moment is still, what's it called, uh, Takirium. I think that's still our main enemy for the next game. And the preparation for the main story right now is uh, trying to fight against her. Probably what the next episode. It'd be like episode 13 or 14, we'll see the end of it. But uh, I think that's their goal. Where the. This new lake's enemies and the Eve. I think it's going to be kind of like. I don't want to say used, but it's something that the Predwin has to fight up along with others. But more like kind of substring enemy. That's how what it was. So I think the Predwin's event will be tied into conclusion with the Adele. 
and the Eve. Most likely that would be the end of it. But I think I got the story, the music. All the way down here. Well, at the beginning of the story, Tamiya allowed her, so she asked Tamiya about it. So, so Swan is definitely an enemy. Yeah, so if you... The story for the episode 11 talks about Swan a bit. So Swan is an exiler. All the six wing members are exiler, but Swan is also exiler from the other world. And her world has been destroyed by Takirion. So this time now she's working along with Takirion's because I guess she gave something that she can refuse. But Naivin sees her as a betrayal. Because after all, Naivin wants to protect this world, not destroy it. So even for Naivin, uh, she's definitely not the right fit. Anyways, let's try to see if we can run automatically. I'll go through all the nonce. Well, I'm rather surprised how the conclusion ended. But, uh, I guess I thought the uh, Roy's father would have more resistance to it, but seeing the story, I guess it kind of makes sense how the Roy's father is standing up for her after all. Her grandfather. So now he's like taking care of her. So I guess it makes sense. It's a promise he made to her long as time ago.
Did I go through the purple notes? No, I have to go through the this one. That's the one that summons the siege unit, I think. If I if she can kill this thing fast enough without any buff, that means I can run this team automatically. If she can kill this thing without destroying it fast enough, then I guess I just have to. Still not enough. I guess I just have to use a sigma. Her damage is good though. Her damage is good for any other rooms except this boss. Her damage is all good until it hits this boss, basically. This one was X five for it. <laughs> no. Not at all. I don't think they would imply that even like a little bit. I think Swan just admires their admin in a different way because of how many words he went through about destructions. It's just seeing someone, it's just an exiler's point of view, I think. Like all these different exilers look at admin. And they kinda admire them in a way. Because admin after all been through so many different worlds. He's basically almost like a regional exiler.
回の任務も成功してな I guess I can't use her auto yet. To use a different thing. She will do in the rain. This team right now, the one I can take out is most. Um, I will have to deploy her later to utilize with the breach threat team, but I hear that you can use her here. So. I have to like switch around gears quite a bit though.
익숙해져 보는 편이 좋겠지. 최신 시기군. 익숙해져 보는 편이 좋겠지. 최신 시기군. 익숙해져 보는 편이 좋. I'll just try this one out. See how it goes. 우리 이기고 살아서 돌아가. I think it's just that her damage is up is so high anyways. No, it's not that. <sighs> How it works with the Lucid is that you need this character, Baka. What she does is that uh, she increases the defense of the corrupted objects. So her um, Lucius summons can be buffed by this thing. Yeah. Increase your damage. Uh, damage. Uh, what's it called? Damage reduction buff. So that's how it works. The well, summon works. I think I want to switch her gears though. Maybe I use uh, Mina's gears on this. Chat, 
But if I use this, that means I get way less crit damage. I mean, the skill rate. So I'm just literally betting on the raw damage itself. She died for you. I guess Maze pulled out of this then. Tried to get different set, but they don't work. Oh, sure, she was alive for 20 seconds. 20 seconds, eh? Okay, then let's do something else here. Um... I think this should work. Range damage. Okay. <laughs> 
guess timer isn't any much much faster. Better than not having it. I guess I just have a different build. You can utilize her. I don't think it's much faster than what I use anyway. If I had BBN and level 8, that might be different, but... It's okay. It's okay. But anyways, thanks for watching for this one. I'm gonna go to sleep now actually. <laughs> I wake up like one in the morning. Barely had a sleep after work yesterday. I'm just gonna sleep for a bit and wake up and think about what's gonna happen. But that was a pretty good story. I really enjoyed it. Uh, we'll go and test Eve more, but it seems like she has pretty good damage already. So I think uh, she's definitely going to be doing really well in some of the PB contents where the tanking is less required and more damage is always good. So we'll see. Anyways, thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.